Well, you see what's going on. I'm getting saddled up right now. Bringing the mule. Old Faithful Red over there. Just getting ready to go. Go right up in the mountains. I had a little boo-boo this morning. Cut my hand. Had to get that doctored up real fast. Now we're on our way. But almost July. We're going to see what the mountain pass looks like. Should be pretty good. It's PCT trail. So see how much snow those up top or what's left. See what's passable. Yep. Other than that, it's time for riding season now. Out here, the other mules staying behind this time. Just go do two. All right, we'll see you out there on the trail. Got up here. We've got a little bit of a rain going on right now, but it's all right because we're already here, so ain't nothing to it. But just go do it. Get a little wet today. Just like last time. Be alright. Stay tuned. Starting out. Still raining, but being some tree cover so it'll help a little bit. Not too bad yet. Get there. Get a little bit of rain on us today. See what it turns out to be. Saw only two two trucks at the trailhead. No no horse trailer, so probably won't run anybody riding horses, go figure. But see what it looks like. Get some miles covered today. See if the trail is pretty good or not. Should be. It's a PCT, so. Started running into a little bit of snow. Probably two miles in. It's not too bad. Dogs are enjoying it. Having a little fun. Well, we're starting to hit some problems here. End of June, made it to the first lake, I think it's called Leaf Lake. But, we're starting to really get some deep snow drifts and it's not hard enough to walk over. And it's not soft enough to go through. This might be the end of the trail see what it's looking like well dang it is a little deep and it keeps going but it's not really way around it either so I think I think that's gonna be it I think that's gonna be it guys PCT, I don't know, what's today, June, end of June, 27th, maybe 26th, somewhere in there. Not making it through. I guess I have to wait another month here too. Not too many places that we can really get up into the high country yet for whether trails are cleared or snowed in, can't make it through. I don't know, hopefully two, three, two three more weeks maybe all this snow melts off or enough to get through but we've already gone through probably 
I don't know, six, seven of them already. So, we'll skirt our way back and head back to the trailer probably. These are unfortunate, but I don't know, there's another trail too that's on the other side that maybe we'll take for a little bit and see where that goes. I think that goes down towards Dog Lake. So we'll see, maybe we can get through over there. Extend our ride a little bit more before we head on home. Kel's back here. Half-ass adventures. And this is turning into a half-ass adventure. So, I don't know. We will see. PCT ride, as far as we made it. There's a lot of snow banks up here. Snow drifts, snow banks, whatever you want to call it. The snow is soft and hard at the same time. It's hard enough for us to walk over, but soft enough where the animals are sinking. So we're not going to make it much further. We've already crossed like five, six, seven of them. We're going to end up having to go back down. There's another trail that we're thinking about heading in on. Maybe a couple miles, see what it looks like, see if it's been logged out or if it's snowed in too. Because we're still early enough, let's might as well ride while we're up here. Um, Animal's doing pretty good. Trail's not going to be bad. We're end of June right now, so I don't know, maybe July, end of July, you'd be able to come up through here, at least with animals. I'm sure there's been some hikers in through here, but there's a lot of snow. And you're not making it up further up into probably the high country without without more of this melting off. So that's what we're going to have to do. So me and Caleb will get mounted back up, and we're going to head back down the trail and see what it looks like on the other side. Back in the campground, make a plan, see if we'll go from there. <coughs> Kelp's up front, there's a little meal, car him up. Maybe you can see him right there. Well. Adios. Decided to stop on the Sand Creek Trail. And let me tell you that it is a straight jaunt up this hill. I bet you we've gone maybe three quarters of a mile a mile and gained a thousand foot elevation it's pretty steep it's not i mean the, the trail's great it's wide doable the trail's real nice but it's just it's a straight jaunt uphill you're continuously going uphill so we're gonna take this up hopefully try to get to the lake that's up here and then turn around and head back we'll see Pretty neat little spot right here. It's off the side of the trail. It's kind of a little shell face, but decent viewing area. Pretty steep. We're probably, I don't know, 1400 feet elevation gain, I would imagine. I would imagine good little climb. Well, we made it up here, Shell Rock Lake. Do not recommend coming. Lake's beautiful. I'm pretty sure I got 10,000 mosquito bites on my head and, and hands. I'm not even joking. It's pretty bad. We've had to clear some trail with a handsaw just to get through. Pretty rocky too, but the trail's real easy other than that. It's be a nice place to come August, late August, September. But right now these bugs are, I would not want to be up here. I don't know if you can see them or not, but there's like 
I don't know, at least a hundred surrounding my hat right now and my head. So we're gonna Rochambeau back down and get out of this because this water right here is just holding mosquitoes like crazy. So I'll talk to you again when I get off this. Yep. On our way back down. Make a good time. Pretty sure I got 10,000 mosquito bites though. So it's all red. But it's all part of it. Exploring in the mountains when it's early summer, you got about a million and a half mosquitoes just breeding up here. But it's a pretty nice trail. Would definitely come back to this trail, just not this early in the season. Wait till late summer, fall time. Well, it's a good ride. About four mile, four and a half miles up to the lake. Four miles back down. And we did probably four miles on the trails. Probably twelve today total. Train bad. Not too bad. Like the truck didn't get broken. Yeah, that's a positive. Truck and trailer didn't get broke into, so that's always a win. Sometimes leaving it on these places right here by the road, you can get a little sketched out trying to leave your stuff, because you never know. People are just shitty nowadays. But we're going to finish getting loaded up, and then we're going to get up on out of here. It's a good day. Good ride. Except for the mosquitoes.